sweet friends welcome to a new vlog if you are new here my name is Kim I'm a third year fifth grade teacher in West Michigan but I'm also just a 26 year old woman living my life and I decided I want to film more of these just like fun sometimes in school sometimes not in school lifestyle type videos I used to do a ton of these back in the day and so that's what I'm doing today I'm gonna do a thrift with me video this morning I woke up and at 7 a.m. I decided I was gonna dye all my hair so this is what it looked like before that clip is from yesterday and then today now it is dark I haven't decided if I like it yet but you know now it's dark and it's something new and I had had my hair light for three years and I just I needed to do something and so I woke up this morning and I said let's follow my impulse and I dyed it so I think it looks pretty good I definitely missed some pieces you can probably tell like through here where it was like balayage still but oh well that's fine so today I'm going to travel a couple of towns over to go to a couple of thrift stores I've gone to before but not in a very long time and then also a couple thrift stores I've never been to before if I feel up to it we'll kind of see how the day goes and then I just made a list on my phone so some of the things I'm looking for today are patchwork jeans or regular straight or mom jeans and then I could maybe bleach them myself and make them fun I'm also looking for some cow print I think that's super fun and then any wide leg pants I actually just thrifted the ones that I'm wearing right now last weekend and then wash them and now I'm wearing them today and I think they're super cute so I'll show you those in just a second also any of these like mock neck little sleeveless tops I really like these these are perfect like under pretty much anything and then anything that's that really pretty light jade green color I love that right now I feel like that's like the in color right now but yes those are the things that I'm looking for that's my checklist so let's just kind of see what the day brings maybe it will be great maybe I'll get nothing who really knows but let me show you my little outfit really you can already see the top so I actually thrifted this entire outfit I thrifted this little tank top last weekend for I think a dollar maybe a dollar 99 and then this cardigan is one of my favorites it's from Poshmark it's from the BP brand which is from Nordstrom and then I am like obsessed with these pants they're definitely too big so I actually had to like I don't know if you can tell I have like a little rubber band in the back holding them up on my body but I think they're so stinking cute I'm not gonna wear my slippers out but I am wearing slippers right now and yeah I just like love these little snakeskin pants I think they're so cute I got these for less than three dollars and I just like totally love them so that's the outfit for today and let's do this okay so I just showed up at the first thrift store I'm parked like right in front of the door and there's people like right inside but it looks like on the door it says they have a bag sale going on and it says clothing only five dollar bag sale so I don't know we'll see what that looks like and I've only been to this thrift store I think one other time so I'm excited to go in and check it out so let's do this it's also like the most beautiful day oh my gosh I'm excited so the store was just like a local store and it didn't have a ton of stuff but I still had fun looking around and just going somewhere that I hadn't really gone to before I think I only went to this place like one other time so they had some books and clothes and just like random odds and ends I did try on a couple of things this patchwork jean jacket I didn't know if I like loved it or hated it I couldn't decide and then that's kind of that light jade green I was talking about so I love that jacket I think that's so stinking cute so I had to try it on so first I tried on this patchwork denim kind of like shirt jacket shacket is that what the kids call it I don't know but anyways I tried that on first and didn't love it I just like didn't really see myself wearing this it was like a little bit too old lady for me <laughs> even though I like old lady style it was like too much even for me so that was the brand size medium I thought the buttons were super cool and like I do like the embroidery a lot honestly like watching this footage back I kind of like it I don't know and then this jacket was just too big if it was like a couple sizes smaller it would have been perfect and there's the brand okay I feel like the settings on this camera are weird hold on let me take off my mask so I'm using my old camera that I haven't used in like forever because it's smaller and actually fits inside my purse so anyways I just feel like the settings look a little funky because I haven't used it in so long but my first thrift store oh 
my seat is squeaking. My first thrift store was a little bit of a fail, not like too bad. They actually had a lot of cool vintage stuff. I tried on a couple things, which you guys just saw, but I didn't see anything that I really wanted to bring into my house. So that's okay. They were really nice there though, but I didn't really record much of like the racks or anything because there were a bunch of like very elderly people there and I didn't want to alarm them. And also I was trying to like keep my distance and stuff too. So anyways, Yes, on to the next. Here we go. Okay, I just got to the second store I'm going to go to. So this one is a Mel Trotter thrift store. So let's go in and see if they have anything good. This one is another really small one, so I don't know how much I'll really be able to vlog inside, but we'll see what we can find in there. For being a smaller thrift store, this thrift store seriously had so many clothing items. Like, I feel like the majority of their store was just clothing. Eighth grade Kim used to wear a lot of zebra print and I'm still like weirdly attracted to it and I know it's like coming back in style but I don't know if I'm like mentally prepared to be eighth grade Kim style again, you know what I mean? Okay, so I'm parked like right by the door so it's hard to see but I just went into this Goodwill and left. I didn't even bother filming before I went in or once I left, well, Wait a second, let me think about this. So I didn't bother filming before I went in or while I was in there because it's like super, super tiny and I didn't find anything. So not the best luck for today. Hold on, I'm setting you down. So let's think about this. I don't know where to put you, so I'm just gonna hold you. I have not had the best luck today. In fact, I've had pretty poor luck. So I don't know exactly where I'm gonna go next, but let's figure it out. There's like so many people walking right here because I'm parked right by the door. Okay, I'm gonna go somewhere I don't think I've ever gone before. Off we go. Okay, we're gonna try another Goodwill and hopefully this one is better. I spent quite a while at this Goodwill just looking through stuff. I found like some nasty gal, kind of fun. Not really something I would wear, but still kind of fun. Some like OG Abercrombie and Fitch grandma sweater. Lots and lots of plaid, which I always look at the plaid even though I like never buy it. <laughs> I don't know why I'm drawn to it. So I did end up finding a bunch of stuff here to bring into the dressing room, which I was so excited about. How stinking cute is that um, Ralph Lauren little collared blazer thingy? I don't know, so fun. And then this denim shirt jacket shacket thing. I thought that was cute. And then this blazer, oh my gosh, how fun. Is that vintage? I don't know. How do you tell if something's vintage? I'm not really sure, but found some good stuff to try on so this was definitely the store where I did the best so first I tried on this denim shacket shacket jacket and I love how long this is so stinking cute as soon as I put this on I was like yeah I need this in my life like how cute is that even though I have other denim jackets and shirts and stuff like this one I feel like is different from my other ones because it's so long and I love the big pockets at the bottom too I think that's so cute And then I had to try on that long black blazer. Love, love, love this. I just think this like elevates any outfit, even like the outfit I was wearing. I don't think I'd wear it button, but nice to know that that's an option. So cute. I was like really excited about this one. It's not really like something I would normally pick out, but I feel like it just like looked kind of fun. I don't know. Maybe not with the outfit I was wearing that day, but I don't know, just in general. And then I wanted to love this. It just was a little bit too big. This was the Ralph Lauren little blazer with like the fur collar. I love this, but yeah, just a little bit too big and I couldn't really picture myself wearing it with like the sleeves so long and I'm, I'm not gonna sew it and I'm not gonna get it tailored. So it didn't quite work, but it was cute. <laughs> 
And then I tried on this little tunic length button up top. I think this one was from Old Navy. I also picked out that sweater in the back, but I didn't even end up trying it on because I was like, me. I didn't really feel like it was something I would wear. Okay, so it's a few days later now. Jack is in the back of the frame checking out my new clothes, but I only ended up getting three things. Two things I actually got while I was out and about that I think you saw me try on, I'm pretty sure at Goodwill. And then another thing I ended up picking up later, but I didn't film when I went into this thrift store. So I didn't do like wonderfully, but I did okay. And so I thought I would show you what I got to kind of just end off this vlog. So I did end up picking up the kind of long line blazer that I tried on from the last Goodwill that I went to. It is from the brand Willie Smith looks like this. It definitely looks like an older tag and this was $5, I believe. I think it was like $4.99. So I thought that was a pretty good deal for this long blazer. And I just figured this was something I could wear open over like literally anything. I could wear this over what I'm wearing right now or basically anything else. And I just thought this was really cute and would add a lot to an outfit. So I got that. And then the other thing I got from that Goodwill is this super cute long denim jacket and it's really more of like a shirt material so I like that because it's not like super stiff you can definitely like move and groove in this and there are a bunch of like rips and some distressing here so I don't know that this is something I would wear to school necessarily but it'll be great for the weekends and I kind of want to add some little patches I actually ordered some patches from Amazon that are just like iron-on ones and they're like little stars so stay tuned maybe I'll try to do that on a video and then the last thing you guys have not seen yet but it's another Super cute blazer. I thought this was so fun. It's a little bit big, but not too big. So I think I can make it work. It's from the brand John Meyer of Norwich. The tag looks like this. And I ended up getting this from Salvation Army for $5.99. So $6, which I thought was a pretty good deal for this super cute jacket. It has shoulder pads, which is fun. And then I just thought this beading was so cool. So yeah, this is neat. And again, I can wear this over like basically anything. And I just thought it would add a little bit of pizzazz to basically any outfit. So that is all for this thrift with me vlog. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this. I know it's different from what I've been posting on my channel, but I just wanted to do something different. And yeah. So I hope that you enjoyed this. If you did, please make sure to leave me a comment below so I know that you'd like to see more content like this in the future. Also, please give this video a thumbs up so I can see that you enjoyed it and subscribe, do all the fun stuff, and I will see you on Sunday with my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.